John Kiyong was born on August 7, 1992 in Ulsan Metropolitan City. When his homeroom teacher told him to write down the first to third desired jobs in his school days, he wrote down the other's answers because he had no dream those days. Meanwhile, six months before his college entrance exam, he asked himself, I'll turn 20 soon. What can I do well? Jung Ki Young is 187 cm tall because he inherited the genes from his father who was a valuable player. Perhaps because of that, he unconsciously thinks of becoming a fashion model. So he searched in Jisik Ayan how to become a fashion model. Then he happened to see a video of Isu Hyo, who was a fashion model at the time and made up his mind to do the modeling. So he told his parents. However, his parents answered, Hey, if you go to Seoul, there are a lot of kids who are taller than you, have small faces and have big eyes. So what are you going Going to do. However, in the end, they supported Zhang Kiyong's dream, prepared a lot for the entrance exam, even the chance of passing is 1%. And guess what? He passed the musical and theater department at Union University. So he started his modeling career in 2012 at the age of 21. At the time of his debut, he was wearing braces, which worries him because models with braces are rare. However, contrary to concerns, fashion industry professionals show interest to the boys wearing braces, leading him to have more modeling opportunity than others. So this beloved actor successfully became a model and went on to appear in various MVs, two of which are with the beloved singer IU. Chang Ki Young is one of the biggest rising stars of 2018. The actor has been making a name for himself with his excellent acting chops. This 1992 liner has been around for a while. He started acting back in 2014 as a supporting role making his drama debut in SBS, It's Okay, It's Love. He is a part of YJK Plus and YG Entertainment, a part of the growing team of YG models which also includes Nam Joo Hyo and Lee Sung Kyung, along many others as well. His first project was with Lee Sung Kyung, his fellow label mate in the popular key drama It's Okay, It's Love, and slowly but steadily rose to the top. He played the second male lead in Goba Couple, which gained him the title of the most swoon-worthy second male lead. His appearance in My Ajoshi was controversial. He started the year with a supporting role in the amazing TV and drama My Ajoshi, where he played the bad guy role, shocking his fans who are used to see his cutie side more often. In a particular scene at the beginning of the drama, he hits Ayu's character. Netizens weren't happy with that scene and ended up reporting it to the Korea Communication Standards Commission. As a result, the drama received a warning for the violent, gruesome scene. Despite that, his performance in the drama is considered one of his best so far. He displayed a wide range of emotions that made it hard to believe he started out as a model. Come and Hag Me was his first leading role. In the, same, in the same year, he led the MBC drama Come and Hug Me and stole fangirls' hearts with his good looks, beautiful smile, and great acting. This is not an easy thing to come by. Leading roles in public channels' dramas aren't always so easy to come by, but Tang ki Young was up for the challenge. He called it as a precious opportunity when asked about it during the drama's press conference. And despite the fact that it was his first leading role, the, the drama actually came on top of its time slot for a good number of times during its runtime. Time. And in this drama, he received a Male Excellence Award in the Miniseries category in the Best New Actor Award in the TV category. He used to date actress Lee Yena. Chang Ki Young had been in a relationship and ended it earlier in 2018. A report from Dong A News claimed that he was dating actress Lee Yena for the past year. They were spotted on several dates in many locations such as Thailand. In response to these rumors, YG Entertainment confirmed that the two used to be a couple indeed but revealed that they had broken up earlier in 2018. He can rap. Maybe it's because Chang Ki Young is a part of YG Entertainment, he is a good rapper. The actor who used to model shock fans when he made an appearance on Tribe of Hip Hop and even made it to the top 10 finalist list. He rapped to his agency son Beitop's Doom Dada and shocked the audience with his good pronunciation and smooth rap. And recently he made a noise again in his movie Sweet and Sour. And what's interesting in his next project is he will be starting the drama along with Song Hye Kyu, ex-wife of Song Joong Ki, titled Now We're Breaking Up. Looks like it's a busy year ahead for Zhang Ki Young.